so I'm here to do Grayson's two month update. He will be joining me for the video, obviously. Oh, what's the matter? He was sitting in the mom room, but he was getting annoyed with that, so I figured he would go ahead and join us. He turned two months old five days ago. I don't know if I said that right, but I wanted to wait until his two month checkup to make the video because I knew he'd be getting weighed and measured and getting some shots and I wanted to talk to his doctor about some other things. So yeah, we'll go ahead and jump right into it because I have a lot written down to talk to you about. Gray is in pajamas. I promise these aren't his pajamas that he slept in last night. Uh, we woke up and I started getting him dressed and I was like, you know what? He's going to get shots today. I just want him to be comfortable. So I feared I'd put a new clean sleeper on. So he's just going to be comfortable today since he had some shots and I, I fell back for him. Last month, if you remember, he had quite a few first, um, first events, like social events. He went to a wedding and a baby shower and unfortunately we um, we had a funeral to go to. My grandpa passed away last month. Well he had more firsts this month. We went to his first pumpkin patch. Huh. We got to go pick out some pumpkins. And we had his first church ceremony. Not counting um, like going to the wedding, going to the funeral service. Um, but this is like his first actual, like real mass that he went to. Okay, so he was weighed at his appointment today and he now weighs 14 pounds and 11 and a half ounces. And he measured at um, 24 and a half inches long, which I cannot believe how big this kid is. And I mean, he's just, a solid kid like if you look at him well he's got a sleeper on so you can't really tell um if you look at him he's not really a chunky baby i mean he's got chunky cheeks and that's pretty much it i mean his his little thighs and his little wrists they're not really rolly yet but he weighs like what like 14 and a half pounds so he is a big big boy and i have his charts right here he is in the um, 87th percentile for length and um, weight, he is in the 88th percentile. So almost 90th percentile for both height and weight. He is in size 3 to 6 month clothing and he's still in size one diapers because we um we still have ones to use up that like they fit him but he'll definitely be in a two um when these are up. i put him in um i put him in a size two for our honest company diapers just because they seem to run a little bit smaller than pampers so when he's in his honest diapers he wears twos but um if he has on pampers he's still in a one in pampers Gray eats every, um, probably like every two to four hours, depending on um, if he's been awake or if he takes a long nap. He'll wait a little bit longer to eat if he's napping. Or um, if we're out and we're doing something, he'll seem to go longer without eating. But if we're at home and just kind of hanging out, sometimes he'll want to eat like every hour and a half. And I think it's because he's a big comfort nurser. I don't necessarily think he's always hungry when he wants to eat because I can tell when he's really eating versus when he's just kind of, just kind of hang out there. So I definitely think that he, you know, he just likes to be close and he likes to be with me and he likes to eat. He's not really on much of a schedule throughout the day yet. Like I kind of try to put him down for a nap around noon, but that doesn't always happen. He'll take, he'll usually take like one solid afternoon nap during the day, but it's not always at the same time. Around nine o'clock, I will start getting him ready for bed and that's when we do like his bath and then I'll put his pajamas on him and then he'll eat one more time. And then by 10 PM, he's usually fast asleep. He'll sleep from 10 o'clock to 5 AM. He'll wake up and eat at five. Then he goes back to sleep. Um, he goes right back to sleep. Like, he knows what he's doing. He goes back to sleep, and then he gets up between 
8 or 9 in the morning. So it's a pretty good schedule and I really can't complain about it. What things do you like? What are your favorite things? Gray likes to be held. If you haven't noticed, I'm usually holding him. Um, I think it's the breastfeeding. He is exclusively breastfed, so I think he likes to be close to me, which I don't really have a problem with, but it does make getting things done kind of difficult sometimes. I don't really get housework done as often as I used to, and so I usually have a catch-up day when I'm trying to get everything done, which, I mean, I don't really mind. He'll only be, he'll only be this small now. And that's another thing. I think he might be working on some teeth. I'm not saying he's going to get his teeth right now. I think he'll be one that um, the teething process is pretty long for because he has been so drooly and his fists and his fingers have been in his mouth for like the last like, three or four days. He likes the bath. He has never, I mean since like, I mean he cried in the bath when he was like a week old when we started first giving him a bath at home. But now that he's, um, like used to his you know night routine and taking the bath and everything he's never cried in the bathtub ever he i really do think that he likes it huh you like being in the bath what else do you like you like lights he likes to look at like bright lights and ceiling fans and like things that are up on the ceiling he likes to look at them he likes to track like the fans as they spin or if there's like a big lamp he likes to look at it he likes being sang to and read to um, basically just anything to do with like having contact with him. He likes to know that you're um, giving him your full and undivided at attention. Um, I, I try to read to him at least like once every day. Um, if we're busy, it doesn't always happen though, but I don't know. I, just, I like having that time with him to just, you know, talk to him and focus on him and he focuses on me he likes to sing he likes um he likes the baby bumblebee song and um i mean he's only two months old so i don't know if he really likes it but i mean he smiles when i sing it to him and if he's crying he'll immediately stop and he'll just watch me i don't know if he's just watching me because i'm talking to him or if he likes the song but he likes the bumblebee song and um his dad likes to sing him the Chicago Cubs um, theme song. I don't know if it's like the theme song or their um, like their their anthem that they play like when they win a game or whatever. I don't really know much about the Cubs, but he likes to sing the Chicago Cubs song to him. Huh? He does have a few things that he does not like though. He does not like being strapped into the car seat. He hates it. The, the second I put him in there and I start like pulling the straps over, he starts crying. He hates the car seat. But the funny thing is, once he's put in the car and we start driving, it's like, it knocks him out. He goes right to sleep. I, I can't really think, I can think of one time that he cried in the car. And it was because he was pretty overdue to eat. We were pushing it, but um, we were driving home from, I think my parents' house.